Good morning, everyone. I'm Ed Bates from Kilwood Chiropractic Clinic again, and welcome to another edition of our weekly dose of wellness. So I thought I'd do a little something a little different today. Um, now, one of the biggest benefits for me that has arisen during this whole pandemic has has been reviving some of my old, sometimes healthy habits um, that I've had in the past and routines. And one of them in particular has been my morning routine. And um, I think it was Tim Ferriss who said that if you win the, win the morning, you win the day. Um, so these days I've got into a routine when I get up, I have a glass of water. Um, I do a very quick sort of five minute breathing stroke meditation type of protocol. Um, and then I go off and exercise. And then after the exercise, um, this is what I want to share with you today. Um, I've started having really, really delicious, healthy and nutritious juices. Now, the juice I want to share with you today, um, whilst it's largely made up, um, it has been, so to suppose, inspired by the likes of Jason Vale and Joe Cross. But literally what it is, what we're putting in, very much depends on a day-to-day -day basis. So we've got um, kale from the garden. We've got spinach from the garden as well, um, both of which, I suppose, have been another benefit of, of COVID. Um, I've got two carrots, um, two sticks of celery, three apples, um, a cucumber, um, a lemon with the, 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 the rind taken off, and then two small chunks um, of garlic, of, of garlic, of uh, ginger. Um, so what we basically do is I'm using a, uh, an old sort of masticating juicer. Um, literally, it's got a single auger in the middle, and it literally just squeezes the goodness out of, out of the, 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 the fruit and vegetables. Um, it's different to say the likes of uh, a blender, like the, 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 the Nutribullet. Um, the Nutribullet obviously just smashes things together, just mixes them all up, chops them all up really, really fine. Um, whereas this removes about 90, 90 to 95% of the fiber. So the juice you get from a juicer um, may be less filling, um, but it has much less of the fiber, but the taste is actually purer because you're not actually including the pith and everything in it. Um, as to which is better, I don't know. Um, I suppose it's a personal choice. Um, the Nutribullet would certainly make it a lot thicker. You'd have to add liquid. Um, to the Nutribullet uh, to get sufficient sort of juice out of it, to get enough liquid to go through it. So I'm literally just putting all the, the ingredients just in. Um, sometimes it gets back, gets clogged up a little bit. And as you can see, it just, it's a very, very uh, dry sort of pulp that comes out the end. So you really are getting the most benefit and most of the micronutrients um, from the fruit and vegetables. And to me, this is just, it's such a, it's a great start, as I say, to the day. It's just, you're really sort of, you know, refueling with proper, healthy, nutritious um, food. Like, you know, these, all these different colors are full of different phytonutrients, they're different vitamins, different minerals. You know, everything is, 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 is really good. And I just find it's a great start to the day. It sort of just starts you off nice and fresh. Um, and it really, it might not look the most um, appetizing of juices. Like my kids refuse to drink, try, even try it. Um, but my wife and I absolutely love it. As I said, I vary it um, from morning to morning, depending on what's in the fridge or what's in the garden. Um, but invariably, it's, it's these are sort of the... The standard sort of thing is occasionally we might put beetroot in it. Um, I love beetroot. Um, it's again another good thing to put in. Um, courgette occasionally as well. As you can see, it just literally squeezes everything from it. And at the end, your left arm is going to switch over here. So literally, that is just packed full of nutrients and goodness. So I put the last few bits in, and then we finish up with the lemon, which just sort of washes the thing out. Um, I suppose another drawback, really, with the juicer is they're a bit of a pain in the neck to, 
for clean. Um, but that said, I think the benefits uh, the benefits outweigh the risks really onto here. So to say, like literally, there's absolutely no liquid left at all. And then it's just a case of just mixing it together and then drinking it. And that is really my latest sort of um, morning ritual um, that I must say I'm really enjoying. And it definitely does set you up for the day. I find if I don't get exercise in the morning, um, I'm unlikely to exercise over the course of the day. Um, but this certainly helps sort of get my energy levels uh, renewed and refreshed. Um, so anyway, I hope you enjoyed that. Um, I would certainly suggest trying it. Um, as I said, it is full of essential micronutrients. You know, so often, I think in our nutrition, we talk more about macronutrients, the carbohydrates, the proteins, and the fats. But we actually overlook the quality of the micronutrients. And these are obviously essential um, for your bodies to heal your bodies to regenerate, um, your bodies to sort of you know, have a strong immune system, which obviously at this time uh, what we're going through is obviously crucial. Um, so every little bit will help. Anyway, hope you enjoyed that. And in the meantime, we'll see you next week. So stay safe, stay healthy, and stay happy.